Hello everyone. So now I'm going to discuss another example for converting the Cartesian form of the complex number into the polar form. So this example is about the third, fourth quadrant. So step number one is to have the argon diagram and locate the value of z. So in this case, z is equal to 6 minus 8i. The location of the z will be on the first quadrant. I'm sorry, fourth quadrant. So 6 minus 8i. So this one is the theta. Imaginary part. Real axis. So the second step is to determine the value of modulus z. So the modulus of z will be equals to 36 plus 64. So the modulus of z will be equals to 10. The third step is to determine the argument of z. So we will begin with tangent theta equals to 8 over 6 y over x. Do remember, ignore the negative sign. So theta will be equals to 53.13 as a basic angle. And then in the mode radian, my answer will be 0 0.9273 radian. So now we are going to determine where is the location or we can say the argument of z. So refer to the fourth quadrant. This is our location for the z. This is our theta. Okay. So where is the argument of z? So in this case, the argument of z must start from the zero. So this is the argument of z. So previously I have mentioned if anticlockwise, it will be a positive value. If anticlockwise, it will be positive value. If it's a clockwise, it will be a negative value. So for this case, the argument of z is equals to negative. 0 0.9273 because it is a clockwise okay so finally the polar form z will be equals to 10 cos negative 0 0.9273 plus i sine negative 0 0.9273 so here we are and Thanks for watching.